the SSO, or the special source operations, are a kind of a group of programs, which are among some of the most controversial, potentially transgressive things that the NSA were doing. And the logo for that program is this incredible bald eagle and, you know, symbol of American sovereignty, holding the world in its talons, like in these kind of ropes. I always kind of thought that this was a very important image to highlight. And directly below this is another kind of a more modest center point to the piece. So one of the things that I was trying to find out in the research and trying to kind of exercise in the presentation of this was, you know, who would be responsible for making these images um, within the NSA? So who were drawing these cartoons? Who was kind of imaging these logos? We came across the kind of homepage and uh, CV, uh, LinkedIn and portfolio websites of an artist by the name of David Darchicourt. Darchicourt kind of had all these amazing kind of images of posters that he'd made um, while he was at the NSA. He was the creative director, and um, Charlotte Higgins from The Guardian came in a day before we opened Venice. Um, I gave her a, a long tour of, um, of the vitrines and of the concept of the project through Dutchie Court's own imagery and through the um, you know, supposedly authorless slide images. And she contacted Dutchie Court, called him up and said, hey, do you know this, this show about you? There's a kind of amusing on the authorship of these slides. Are you responsible for some of this imagery in the Snowden release? slides and she's and he uh, responded yes um, actually this poison nut um, image which is here in the vitrine behind us below the eagle uh, was something that he designed and this was a really big moment for me in my research and in the project in general because uh, to my knowledge it's the first time uh, that somebody had actually given author attribution to you know material that supposedly couldn't really be claimed authorship to and to have somebody who worked at the NSA claim authorship for some of this was an amazing kind of you know confirmation of my I believe that um, image-based research and cultural research has um, a, a really strong part in uncovering really important information.